Okay, I'm back with the Tack Life 1.8 cubic foot safe. So this digital lockbox obviously has a key option and a digital key option. So that's what most of us are going to want to use. So similar to like I showed you in the unboxing video, you're going to take the key here, you're going to turn it, all right, and unlock the door, okay? So once we're unlocked, you're going to go ahead and put your batteries in here. So if I turn this, you can see here, this is where the batteries go. So this just slides off like so, and you can see that I've gone ahead and put four AA batteries in there. So just put your batteries in there and go ahead and close it. So now we can, we can close it now and it'll lock. If um, you don't have the instructions manual around, you can use the key to reopen it, but it'll tell you in the manual that by default, one, five, nine, is what opens it okay so that's how we know we can open it again if we need to once it once it has batteries now if we look inside here you can see up in this corner maybe can't it's kind of hard right up here is a little green button let's see if i turn it a little more if you can see it there you go you can kind of see there you go you see it right there that green button is the reset button so what we're going to do so that we can set a new code is i'm going to push that button Okay, and now we can just put in a new code, one, two, three, four, pound. So that accepted the code, we heard that double beep, you can do a code anywhere from three to eight digits, um, and then you're good to go. So if I close it, it's locked, and I do one, two, three, four, now we're unlocked, good to go. So very easy to go ahead and set that code. Of course, all the directions are included in the user manual. So if you do forget how to do any of them, they are right here, or you can just watch this video. This will show you how to do that. I'll do another video where I show you how to um, reset the master code. And that'll be another code that always unlocks it. And you can then set you know, different user codes as well. Okay, thanks. Okay, I'm back with the TacLife 1.8 cubic foot safe. This is model number 50SA, and I am going to show you how to go ahead and set the master code. I showed you how to do user codes, and you can go ahead and set multiple user codes, anywhere from three to eight digits, but then you can also set a master code that's going to open no matter what, and that can again be three to eight digits, but there's a little different uh, mechanism to going ahead and setting that master code. So earlier I set the user code of one, two, three, four, and then you just hit pound, right? So that unlocks it. So that was our user code. Now we're gonna wanna set a new master code. So the difference here is we're still gonna use that reset button that's on the inside of the door here, but first we're gonna hit zero twice. So just hit zero, zero, and push that button. And now we're ready to set the master code. So we can go ahead and do one. Let's pick one, one, four, seven, eight, nine, and then we can hit pound. All right, and a double beep, so that means it's been accepted. So that's our new master code. So now we're locked. We can go ahead, we can go one, four, seven, eight, nine, pound. That's gonna unlock it, okay? And then if we still want to try that user code of one, two, three, four pound, that's going to work as well. So just shows you a different way of setting the code so you can have that master code and then each person can have an individual user code if you would like. So again, this is the TAC Life 1.8 cubic foot safe model number 50SA. Thanks.